Hi everyone and welcome back to the Alan Kane's Daily Alan Kane's Daily Blog YouTube channel. Yeah, big massive shout out to shout outs to the following PT Block Vlogs. They basically do fairgrounds and stuff. I've just been what I've just been going through some of their I've just I had just had one of their blogs. Uh Yes, last night I thought, well, since I had nothing to do, I'll uh, I'll have a listen, to see what uh, see what was going on. Yeah, they were in Bradford. Um, yeah, and uh, yeah, they had some really good rides there. But what one of the things I have been hearing is that uh, what happened at Blackburn is that Silcots came to Blackburn. And some rides, like they were meant to have a fur, well, they, they, they had a fur at, for three days at Witten. But only half the rides went to Witten. Yeah, half the rides went to Witten. And what happened with that? The other half went to Corporation Park. And uh, that's what, that's what really happened. Going past, going past the pancake place and uh, cheesecakes and stuff like that. It's pretty, it, it, it's pretty good actually. It's a, it's really nice, but I can't, I can't eat there because they don't do a diabetic option. So I'm just having a walk down now. I'm having a walk down to uh, the bus station. And if you haven't liked and subscribed to the Alan Kane's Daily Blog YouTube channel, please do so. And uh, if you've got any comments or suggestions, please leave them in the comments section below. But please try and keep the uh, comments and suggestions civil, please, because uh, you know I'll just delete those if uh, if they're there. Um, yeah, as you most probably, probably can say, it's a busy, well, busy, um, busy Blackburn Town Centre at the moment. It's not as busy as it usually is, but, uh, but uh, you know, we're just having a walk down Murray's, we're going past the... Oh, is this a hairdresser's or is it a restaurant? It's a hairdresser's. Yeah, hairdresser's, hers. Yeah. It's a hair salon above the bank. Yeah. And on the top floor. I thought the bank had the, I thought the bank had the first add all the building. But I'm wrong. <laughs> and there was rumours that the Grove, yeah, this pub here on the corner, was meant was meant to op reopen, but I very much doubt it. I'm just gonna have a nose it. There's chairs and everything in it. Ready for someone to take take it over, and uh, and that the grove. Let's see what happens. Coming soon. Opening soon. Find friendliest place to meet. Eat, shop, game. Well, it looks like a uh, Warhammer place is going to open here, I think. Find us on Facebook. Opening soon. Friends list place. Mm. I think this is something similar to the one they have in Bolton. I think. 
Yeah. I've no idea what it's going to be, but we'll soon find out when it opens. Um, is it going to be one of those? It's going to be one of those places that it's uh, it's going to be a game zone. We'll soon find out. Um, yeah, Blackburn is a bit. Blackburn can get a little bit messy in places and uh, the bottom of my cane dropped the bottom of my cane dropped off today of which uh, which is a bit of a mess really but well there's not a lot I can do about it so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go on to the bus station and find out if there's, if there's a bus going in now and I'm just going to go in now and find out if that's my bus coming in and I'm going to go to I'm going to go to but I'm going to Notre Dame Gardens and uh, have a walk and then get off there and see what happens I just hope everybody's having a great day and it wasn't meant to be like this today the forecast has got the forecast wrong once again they always get it wrong um, I'm going to have to put my mask on in a minute because I'm about to enter a building yeah here we go yeah here we go we're going into a building I can't even have a drink right? the, the regulations here have changed of, of late uh, you can't even have a drink in here now you know and uh, yeah and I think basically what's gone and happened is there is uh, nobody sat there <laughs> that's uh, different he must be sat somewhere the bad the really bad smell of sewage in this uh, bus station <laughs> you know the sewage must be backing up I'm just having a walk up now and uh, we'll try <laughs> excuse me I'm going to have to wash my mask when I get home but where are we? further on, three minutes yeah? We we'll have to go to stand ten, I think. I think it is. Soon find out when I get there. If I get there, when I get there. So I'll just have a walk up, and uh, yeah. It looks like they're going to be removing the uh, old. Yeah, looks like they're going to be taking it out. So. Yeah, we'll just have a walk up. We should we should have a departure in about three minutes. There are people getting on it, so I'm gonna have to step it up a little bit. So, yeah, I'm just gonna have to step it up a little bit. So. Quite a fair few people waiting for the 22, and uh, it should be okay. So, no worries. That's the only masks up. Yeah, they're taking the kiosk off because nobody would take it. So, that means both. Both kiosks will be off the station, guys. That means both uh, kiosks will be off the station and put into put into the market for storage. And then once that's done, well, that there'll be no uh, you know 
What they should have really done is put vending machines in like Preston has. Um, and it would have been a lot better. And the toilets here, they should basically do the same as what they did with Bolton bus station. Put a complete total turnstile in there. So that, uh, you know, so that people can't, you know, jump the jump the turnstile one that they've got in because I am damn well sure that that uh, loses a lot of money so they should add something like the one they have at Bolton bus station and if they did that if they did that that would be far better than the thing that they've got in at Blackburn here and at Bolton, they've well, since they put that that turnstile type of entrance in, they've seen their, they've seen their revenue increase by 25%. And uh, yeah, you could they couldn't you couldn't uh, quibble about that. And if you get stuck, there's a but there's a button at the side which you press which you press to let yourself to let yourself out because the then because it's because it's one it only goes in one direction but you have to hit this button inside then it releases it to go the other way so you can get out and uh yeah it's far better than what blackburn has now we're just waiting for this number 22 bus to go to that goes to Clitheroe. Mm. It'll, it'll have a, it'll have a crew come along and clean the, clean the damn thing, hopefully. Uh, it's, we're just wait, waiting for this bus to turn up. It's running late from, it's running late from Shadsworth, because that's where it comes from. So, here we go. We'll get on the bus, get off at the toll bar. And uh, once we get off at the toll bar, and this is time to see if this pass works. We'll see if this... We'll see if, the pa see if my pass works or not. If there's the case. Twenty first of March, twenty first of March, twenty twenty three. So we'll just have a, you know, see what happens. He might even tell me to turn the camera off. But then again, he might not because they have cameras on the bus. So I just hope uh, everybody's having a good day. Me, so far so good. And uh, you'll have to get the next available bus when it when it comes. In. You'll have to get the next available bus when it comes in so we'll see so we'll get off get in get on uh, toll bar please thank you very much Thank you, Have a sit down and I'll be right. Uh, yeah, yourself. Hey, yeah, hello there. It's always on. You keeping alright? Yeah, I'm alright. Good. Yeah. Not too bad. Not too bad at all. 
tell you something, they got they got today wrong, didn't they? Yeah. It, it, it meant it, it was meant to be meant to be raining. But uh to Yeah. I don't know. Well my mates my mates uh my mates over in Vegas, they're, they're having temperatures of, 100 and, of 107. Yeah. yeah, it's 107. It's 107 there at the moment. There's rumours that. Uh, They're going to do arts and crafts here, here, and also there's, you know, the they're going to do like it's independent, independent brewers as well there as well. So we'll just yeah, have. The Euro for the arts. Yeah. So we'll just have to see how it goes. Well, at least, at least they're using it for something. Yeah, something. Yeah. Something, really. yeah. <laughs> and uh, leaving it, to, leaving it to rot. Yeah. Yeah. But uh, the, they're talking about uh, you know what used to be the borough down at the other end. Yeah. They're talking about uh, reopening that. And. Uh, they open it as a as a either a pub or a restaurant. We'll just have to wait and see. They have another one of them at the other side of Blackburn, you know, they, you know at uh, Old Fire Station? Yeah. They've got one there at the other side. Um, yeah, well they... Alright. Thank you. Time to get off. Thank you very much. I'm off. Let's wait for this bus to move out of the way. And uh, we'll have a walk up. We'll have a walk up to the We'll have a walk up to Sandy Path. Yeah, we'll have a walk up to Sandy Path and it should be fairly decent. Right, let's go. We'll turn, we'll turn right, we'll turn left in a minute, and we'll walk up, and we'll go to, up to up up to Sandy Path, and uh, we'll go this way, yeah. And have a look at James Hargreaves' bathrooms whilst we go past. It's something that I can't afford. <laughs> oh, I couldn't afford those prices, I tell you. And, uh, yeah, I'm having a walk up. Since I get home, I'm going to have to change the end of this cane. Oh, can you hear that? Can you hear that? That's the end. That's the end that's come off. That the part of the part of the uh, cane had come off. So yeah, not good. Um,
so we'll just have a walk up don't worry folks there will be videos going up today uh, if I don't manage to get them all up today uh, is one thing but I'll spread the videos out a little bit for when for you know for you to watch sort of thing now right, here we go it's a bit like Victorian plumbing Victoria plumbing Victorian plumbing look at that that thing is how would you how would you get in that Fox, how would you get in that? <laughs> yeah, that would be problematic. That would be problematic. And actually, no water, no water actually goes. I don't know. I don't know. What are the what are the toilets like at James Hargreaves if you gotta go for a crap? Yeah? What are they like? Yeah? That's, a, that's one of their showers. They have one of those at Jenny's house. That shower there. But it has a seat in it. <laughs> yeah? Sit. So they can have a sit down shower. And this is what they call. It's called the Vic, the Vic, well, it's not a Victorian thing, but it's the old fashioned, old fashioned toilet. The toilet you used to have outside in your, uh, in your house house, if you had a terraced house. Yeah. I hear that there are still some places that, that are still like that. And the, 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 the tower rail at the back with a radiator you're talking about 200 300 pound for that radiator alone the bath well i wouldn't like to have a guess but i, I wouldn't like to have that because you know you'd have a very big water bill a very big water bill if you had that there are other stuff there are other stuff in that place as well, but I couldn't exactly go in there and start shooting and start shooting and publi give them a bit of free pub publicity. But you know, James Hargreaves, you know, if you want a, a swish bathroom suite, go there. Um, you can really hear that, you can really, really he he hear at the end of the cane. Uh, you know, making a noise now, and uh, yeah. The end will be changed when I get in. I think I might, I think I might pull one of the roller tips off one of the short canes. The short canes I don't send. The short canes I don't tend to use. So I'm going to take the end off this and place it. Place it on the short cane because I hardly ever use those. So that uh, you know I can I can put put them on the end end of it. So, you know, this is uh, Wally Old You know, I live between Wally Old and Wally New. And a lot of times our estate gets forgotten that, that I'll do a video on. So, yeah, my estate, when it comes to having things done, because of where it where it is. We're not in Daisyfield. We're not in Baswell. We're in between the two. Which 
which area does it belong in? Well, to be truthful, to be truthful and honest, it doesn't really belong to any of them, really. This is the reason why, when I complain to my council, to the council, they say, where? You know, they ask me, what's that estate? And I get, I get, um, funny looks from count from council members say, saying that, oh, Notre Dame Gardens. That's the in between the estate, isn't it? I said, yeah. It says, uh, oh. Uh, what do you want us to do? I said, well, lack of services for, for one. Like when, when, uh, when Whitestone Garage acquired acquired that land at back at back of them, and and uh, the uh, like James Hargreaves and the electrical. LED got their place um, they acquired a piece of land which had ha, ha, had ha, in the past had housing on it and used to be a paper shop there as well well he's, that's gone because of those because of those businesses and to be truthful since then, and there used to be a tat where James Hargreaves is now, there used to be a tattoo shop on the corner. The guy used to come from all, from a, he used to have his, fa his family and everything uh, live there. And he used to come from, he used to commute between, Black, between there and Barn Oldswick. Yeah, because he had another shop, he had another shop at Barn Oldswick for doing tattoos and stuff and in a lot of cases he, he did more tattoo he did more tattoo removals than he did than he did tattoos so you know he, he's probably moved his, his move, he moved his business back to Barn Oswick when that when that row of houses got uh, compulsory purchased to put those uh, put those units there yeah so you, you don't you wonder why they put something like that there you know you'd think they put you'd think they put housing there wouldn't you well sometimes it, it just doesn't it just doesn't turn out that way So, DPD is going on to the estate now. Most probably dropping some parcels off. I don't think we've got anything today. I don't think I've ordered anything, have I? I don't think so. Star Taxis has just gone past. Number of tax companies. I've started to notice, I've started to notice now, more and more and more taxi companies are coming on to the estate. Um, it didn't used to be like that because the estate had a bit of a problem with people, throw, people throwing rocks at taxis but it seems to have it seems to have changed a little nice Land Rover there Discovery probably Adams Yeah, on to have a discovery. It's a nice, the nice, the nice vehicles of discoveries. My dad had one when he was when he was here, and uh, yeah, nice, 
nice uh, nice things to have until it broke down and it started having all of its problems that's the problem with Land Rovers with four wheel drive vehicles there's always, there's always something something that So just having a walk, 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 walk around, and uh, we just uh, just took the camera. That house is just across the road. Has just uh, has been put out to rent. There's one at the top of it, at the top of our cul-de-sac. Was put out to rent. Right, and this is where I leave you, folks. Um, so yeah, and as I saw, up, everybody's had a, had a good day and. Uh, yeah, one le thing leads to another. So I'm going to have to say three, two, one, click. And there will be another video soon. Bye.